Welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. Let's jump into some Bitcoin action here. Bitcoin's never actually recovered uh, from where it is now in previous cycles, right? In the eight years I've been trading, guys, this uh, this doesn't recover usually, right? So if it does recover here, it's going to be something a little bit new, I would say. Uh, it doesn't mean we bang it up from there, of course, but it is something to watch out for. Obviously, we do have some super important levels uh, that we are resting on right now. Okay, one of them being the bottom trap zone of this area right uh, which we did break but we are trying to reclaim uh, if this daily closes underneath 56.9 guys very bad for bitcoin but uh, yeah, we'll get to all of this in a minute. I do just want to show you uh, an indicator real quick that could potentially mean that we head up fairly soon, right? So if we are looking at this right now, you're probably wondering what it is. Uh, this is liquidation levels based on open interest and volume. So if we get enough volume, it's going to calculate essentially a 10x liquidation level from that point, okay? Uh, and then draw in various lines. We've actually disabled everything except 10x 25x and 5x I believe right so we can see here these lines uh, the blue one is 10x and that's what I want you to focus on right here right now okay so uh, as you can see here when we did kind of slap our all-time high uh, we did come down and liquidate uh, this 10x level uh, after liquidating the previous 10x level right what happened after that well we got more 10x levels based on the volume that came in here right and then uh, another line came through right so with this this 10x liquidation level and all this means is right when price gets to here everyone that shorted 10x here uh, gets liquidated if we if price gets up here right so if we are looking at this uh, every single time pretty much um, in this range that we've been in we have actually come down and we've liquidated all the 10x leverage junkies <laughs> right so if we are going to look at this uh, what we are going to say is where is the next lines uh, and is it applicable to be targeting those lines right so if we are looking at this line here this is what i want you to focus on 68k right 68k is the next 10x line here will we hit it very much up for debate have we been in a massive downtrend and we should be expecting some spillover fairly soon yes okay so if we are looking at this in a blunt logical justified manner uh, it does make sense that we revisit 68k and if we did hit 68k uh, it doesn't necessarily mean we bang it up to the moon but uh, it does mean that potentially uh, we do make a lower high in this area retest this zone and then go up from there to get the rest of these 10x bad boys right so uh, keep an eye on this one because this this is data that is valuable it is data that uh, makes sense and it is something that uh, I potentially may be targeting here uh, especially if we do get over these areas around kind of 62 63k uh, upon a potential recovery here and this in itself from our highs right if we go if we go super cautious with this right from our highs uh, our most recent high here that we got rejected on right we can see about 64k would be the entry there all the way up to about 68 and this would be a massive trade a six percent trade uh, is massive okay and on the 10x leverage that's 60 percent 100x oh i don't know why i just did 100x uh, is yeah it's it's a lot more <laughs> right 600 percent so uh, don't obviously 100x if we hit this level that's not what i'm saying guys okay uh, if you want to gamble just check out my shorts and and live through those okay do not do not gamble on bitcoin because you will get destroyed but uh yeah this is just what I wanted to show you here let me know what you think in the comments of this because uh this does make sense right this like they do target the liquidation levels uh, but i do want to show you a quick trade that i did enter here uh let me just show you where is it where is it where is it yeah so uh this looks very convoluted don't get me wrong but uh we did get in a trade from about 57.3 just riding off the bounce off this trend line okay it looked pretty good uh, so we got in right and uh yeah we rode that up to about 57.6 somewhere around there and the reason i can do that guys uh, and, and not get destroyed by the fees is because I'm VIP2 on Fairdesk. If you want VIP2 on Fairdesk, all you've got to do is use the link in the description and sign up. You basically get uh, like 30% or I think it's 50% off your fees or something like this, right? Uh, so it allows you to take smaller scalp trades where you can uh, get money, right? <laughs> to put it simply, you can get money. Uh, because if we were doing this on other exchanges, then yeah, we wouldn't, we'd probably make a buck or something, right? We would make a minuscule amount because of the fees of trading on a leverage. So uh, yeah, 
yeah, just bear that in mind. But um, yeah, if you if you want to check that out, feel free. Uh, besides that, yes, we did put out a uh, a, sig a free signal here on the Patreon. All you got to do is follow on Patreon. You get that free signal. That is this bad boy. All right. So uh, yeah, what we're looking for really is 60k to break. Bang it up to the 60 minute volume weighted ATR man, uh, and then go from there. And all my Patreon vid all of my Patreon content, guys, is in video format now. So uh, the little one minute videos where I just show you the setup I'm looking for and uh, the criteria to get in on it, right? So there is a paid version, but there's also just a free version where I put in a Bitcoin signal every day uh, for you for free, okay? So feel free, check that out, okay? Uh, besides that, I do just wanna say we are currently we are currently seventh, okay? We're seventh on the leaderboard on Fairdesk. Chester is currently third. We're trying to catch him up here, <laughs> but he's trading like a madman, okay? He's, he's crushing it. He's crushing it out here. But uh, yeah, it's, it's nice to see us on this leaderboard here. If you want to check this out, it is on Fairdesk. You can follow me. I do all that good stuff. But uh, yeah, we're on a, a small streak right now. We're looking to continue that, and we're looking to just ladder up this leaderboard and get to the top here, right? That's the plan here. Just a bit of fun, okay? And obviously uh, making money on the side as well. Obviously, this, this account's tiny. It's only 5k in this account so uh yeah it's not not something that's crazy but it is something that i want to get up to 100k uh, and just uh, yeah and, and go from there right if we are looking control right control the the macro we can see energy value today it's a 74 five all right there is one thing i did want to show you that's super important and that is the etf inflows okay we can see these inflows absolutely banging it here this is a great sign for bitcoin super bullish sign actually uh, where we have had very negative uncertain etf inflows pre previously right over the past week but uh yeah we can see here uh, as of the fifth i believe yeah the fifth and this and the eighth because obviously it's not going to do it on the weekend we can see 143 million and nearly 300 million inflows so the institutions are waking up here they're saying hey should we buy some Bitcoin? It's pretty cheap, <laughs> right? And uh, yeah, they're, they're getting involved and the proof is in the pudding there. So we'll see if Bitcoin can react and actually uh, go up with price there. If we are looking at some more on-chain stuff here, yeah, still flatlined, nothing crazy. Miners aren't really on board just yet, but institutions definitely picking up the pace here. And as you guys know, if we are looking at the uh, macro index here, you guys know it's orange right now, which means caution. Okay, when it's green, it's absolute bull time. All right, and uh, yeah, just bang it in, 1,000x long, make loads of money, right? That's the plan on that one. But uh, yeah, as of right now, currently orange, we will chill. If it turns red, very bad for Bitcoin. We will be scared, we will be short, and uh, we will be making money, of course, right? But uh, we would like the I mean, the market's easier when it, when it goes up, right? It's, it's just free money. So uh, ideally, we can get a little recovery there. Liquidation heat map, I think this is not updated. Let me just update this right now. Here we go. So yeah, a lot of levels around that 58,2K, uh, <laughs> 58,2K, uh, 58,200 here, uh, all the way up to, yeah, about 59,000. Uh, there is massive, massive liquidation levels there. So we will see uh, if that does get violated. If we do go back to our chart here, where is that landing? So 58,3 uh, all the way up to about 59k just before uh, our potential move here towards the upside so if it does want to smash through great but that is a lot of uh that's a, a big layer and when you do hit a big layer like that in terms of liquidations you, you should be expecting a pullback so what we're going to do here with this move here guys is if this does head up uh, and it and it does poke its head up into this area what we're going to look for ideally guys is uh, is a pullback first right we get that pullback because uh, all that liquidity is going to be absorbed we get the pullback here right and then as we break that high, we get in the trade. And there is enough room to do that in this area. So good stuff there. If you haven't liked the video yet, absolutely fine. But if you could, I would massively appreciate it, guys. Uh, it does help me out a lot. We're trying to educate as many people as possible here, right? I've uh, been in this space a long, long time. And before I was in crypto, I was trained in uh, in Forex and, uh, and stocks as well, right? So uh, yeah, trading is my thing. And uh, I love Bitcoin. I do love Bitcoin. I want it to succeed. But if, if we do head down here and we have initiated a measurement move down here as you can see right uh, and just to kind of show you that right it's the distance inside the range okay uh, the last wave down all right so we can expect the wave to be a similar length if we dump down from this point okay so what we'd be looking for here is about 53.5 
downwards. If we can get down from that point, um, we can, if we can get in a short around that area, it will be huge and uh, money will be made, okay? Lots and lots of money will be made here. Fantastic stuff. We also got this weekly volume weighted ATR band here. Uh, lots of volatility in this area, don't get me wrong. When you see candles like this, disgusting, usually stay away. But if we break this low, we confirm a little bit of a downtrend here, uh, then uh, yeah, we would get down into this next kind of range area. You can't see that. Whoop. The next kind of range area there. Uh, so yeah, nice 8% trade towards down there. Uh, downside there potentially anyway right um besides that it would be nice to retest this three day and again we were targeting potentially that 68k area right so if we can get up into that zone uh, and liquidate the leverage junkies as we talked about here right 68k up here is the next 10x area then uh, yeah there is that long thing so uh yeah what we will say here is a summary at the end of the day i would say long-term macro looks pretty bearish based on where we are right now okay a short term i would say fairly bullish um i would say fairly bullish if we can reclaim probably 60k if we can surface above 60k we'll be above a lot of trend lines uh, we'll be back on support uh, and uh, it's not going to be the only way is up from there but it will be a glimmer of hope and it will be uh, potential for a nice upwards wave and a spillover after this dirty downtrend here so uh, yeah the summary here again long term bearish uh, as of right now um, obviously long, long-term bullish as long as we stay above this line. As long as we stay above about 40K, guys, uh, we are long-term bullish. But uh, yeah, I would say, okay, so long-term bullish, mid-term bearish, short-term uh, bullish, okay? So I think we, in short, I think we do something like this, okay? I, I really do. And um, yeah, that, that'll be fantastic. There'll be money to be made. We have setups all the way through this. This is what we've been doing here throughout this video. So uh, yeah, I think uh, I think there's money to be made here for sure. Uh, besides that, besides that, uh, if we are gonna summarize as well, we're looking for a trade from 64k to 68k, and we're also looking for a trade from about 50, uh, 59k up to about 60k, and also we're looking for a short from about 56.3 down to uh, yeah 55.6. Okay, easy game. Say something. Say something. <laughs> if you know. Uh, actually, no, I was going to put a little Easter egg in there for my short later, but I messed up the, the linguistics of it. But uh, yeah, we are chilling here. We're waiting for this pattern to break. That's the summary. That's what's going on here. Make sure you trade safe out there because this is a disgusting market. We did get a pretty decent little um, <laughs> a little short uh, today in, in my gambling uh, thing. So I'm, I'm making YouTube shorts, right? But I, I did take a trade short here after I closed my long. Uh, I just banged it in. Uh, and obviously, I wouldn't do this on the copy trading account because uh, it's other people's money. But uh, I like to gamble. I like to record it. And uh, yeah, that turned out to be a nice, uh, I think it was $4,000 trade. Was that right? Or was it 2000 I can't remember. Uh, but it was it was a good trade. It was a really good trade. Uh, and yeah, you'll see that short come out a little bit later. It's only like 15 seconds long. So I'll throw that in the telegram if you want to see that. But um, besides that, yeah, stay tuned. Free update tomorrow again on the Patreon. Just hit follow. You don't have to pay anything. It's absolutely fine. Chill. It's all good. Uh, I actually just want to show you the Patreon real quick and, and just kind of get you familiar with it. Right. But um, yeah, if we are looking at it right now, uh, we can see how this works if it's gonna load hello mate there we go beautiful stuff so you can see yeah you got the paid updates here um there's three paid updates every day okay these are these are very very short videos just one setup on each asset and then we've got our free update here uh which is um which is free right all you gotta do is press follow you don't have to pay anything you don't have to some credit card or anything like that okay you just press follow and then you'll be notified when when i give this free trade setup right uh, besides that Absolutely fine. If you do want to get the paid setups, uh, super, super cheap. Cheapest one is uh, 10 bucks. Absolutely fine. Okay. And then if you want my indicators and courses and stuff like that, then there are the other uh, subscription tiers, of course, right? You can also get these via YouTube memberships as well. But that's going to be it from me, guys. Hope you have a fantastic day. Uh, make sure you trade safe out there. Thank you for liking the video. Leave me a comment. Let me know. Are you, do, you, do you agree with me here? Do you think Bitcoin uh, goes up long term, up short term? and then down midterm. Let me know. Let me know. I did that in the wrong order, but yeah, that's going to be it for me. Peace. Goodbye. Have a great day. And uh, yeah, love you guys. Cheers.